What's good guys? What's good with y'all, man? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new around here, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you aren't new, make sure you hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I post a video. And guys, 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 the Mavs have made their first big move in free agency, picking up JaVale McGee. Um, I'm tripping. I, okay, here we go. Three year, 20 point one million dollar deal with the Mavs so JaVale, JaVale McGee signs with the Mavs for a three-year contract um it looked kind of iffy at first looked like he was headed to the Bucks but the Mavs did scoop him up uh, at this time right now it is 747 Central um looks like Jalen Brunson is definitely indeed out of there um like for 106 mil 109 something 110 I don't know anyways we want to talk about JaVale McGee, what he brings to the team. And uh, yeah, we got a couple of highlights to watch or, you know, a quick short little video. Um, when he scored 19 points, had 14 rebounds, and has his first double-double um, of last year's season versus the Rockets. Now, you guys know the Mavs needed rebounding crazy. And let me just say this, my eye, this one right here is red. I got soap in it. So uh, yeah, you guys don't, kill me in the comment section it burns real bad but and i'm also sick so if my energy is low i'm sick all right so we know the Mavs got killed on the boards um we played pretty small ball we really didn't have a big center um to really get those rebounds the white pals not really uh the go-to guy in that position neither is maxi um as y'all know boban does not play so we re we, re we were really missing that key piece on defense um, a rim protector, somebody who's going to just like, uh, what's the word I'm looking for here? Um, basically make it hard to get buckets in the lane. We didn't have that guy. So once, um, the opposing team got past the, the perimeter defenders, you know what I mean? Like they're not afraid to go up against the white pal, you know, Maxi Kleber is a good shot blocker, but he doesn't really have that center size and he can't play well against, um, Jokic. Uh, Joel and B, they're just too little. So we really need to go out and find a true center. And I believe JaVel McGee is past the Shaq in the Fool days. He's past all those moments and he's actually a really good center. So um, actually, let me pull up his stats real quick so we can see what he was averaging last year versus, um, not versus, but last year in general, 2021 stats. Uh, because we did play him in the playoffs. So. All right, so the 2021-2022 season, he's averaging nine points a game. We need to look at rebounds here. Sorry, I'm, I'm not gonna have it up on the screen right now, or actually, you know what? Let me let me do it for you guys. Let me pull it up on the screen so y'all can be with me, and we'll get into the highlights. I don't plan on this video being real long, uh, so yeah. Dang, here we go. All right, zoom in. All right, so as you guys can see down here, 2021, 2022 season, he was on the Phoenix Sun. So let's go here and look for rebounds, defensive rebounds per game. We're looking at four, but you guys, these numbers are gonna seem really low um, because he doesn't get a lot of playing time. So I wish there was a, a stat on here that showed uh, minutes played. Oh, minutes played, I think this is here. He averages 15 minutes a game. So keep that in mind when you guys are looking at these stats. We have, uh, let's see, free throws, pretty poor. Offensive rebounds, we're looking at two per game, about four and a half a game defensive rebounds. And that's about it, man. But, you know what I'm saying? If we do look at, let's look at Dwight Powell. Let's look at, let's look at Dwight Powell's, uh, percentage here so in the 2021 2022 season my man Dwight Powell averages 21 minutes almost 22 minutes played per game right and he's averaging less rebounds than JaVale McGee on offense on offensive rebounds and defensive rebounds and he's averaging less points so really think about that JaVale McGee is playing how many minutes did we say he played a game? JaVel McGee last season played 15 minutes per game, right? 
Dwight Powell played 21. I'm going to let it soak in. I'm going to let it soak in. This is a W deal the Mavs just got. So uh, we're going to look at some highlights, man. Let me know what you guys think about this trade. Uh, I definitely think it's a great trade. We got somebody for three years for not too much who's a really good center. And he's going to make, or Luca is going to make him even better than what he is. You know what I mean? He was playing with Chris Paul, who is also a floor general. But Luca is definitely going to get him involved in the pick and roll. JaVale McGee knows how to roll for sure. We're going to see if we can see some of his uh, offensive um, abilities displayed in this video real quick. So let's see here. I already have it ready. Pulled up. And here we go. So as you can see, double zero. <clears throat> He's just, you know, somebody that's going to make it hard for guys to score in the paint, bro. That's really what we need. And that's on Christian Wood. So imagine, let me know what you guys think the lineup is going to be. But Luca, you know, you got um, THJ or Reggie Bullock at the two, one of those. For the three, you have Dodo for sure. For the four, you got Christian Wood. And the five, you have JaVale McGee. Now I have seen that the Mavs are looking at options to get rid of uh, Tim Hardaway Jr., Bertans and somebody else. Somebody else, but I don't think the Mavs are done this uh, this free agency right now, this offseason. I don't know how tall he is. We could probably check after this, but like, look, like he's he's active. No, nobody's doing that. He's he's active. There we go. And I know y'all remember that time he. Uh, I think he stole it from Luca and took it coast to coast. He's he's athletic, man. He's athletic. Y'all just watch JaVale McGee, like, just watch him work. Really does a good job of getting his hands up and not really bailing out um, the offensive player. Good pick there. Good way to uh, show show for the uh, Devin Booker, but also get back. Because if you guys look at that play, he could really lob it right here. Because JaVale McGee's going to get up. And Luca's gonna make sure he puts it up there. You feel me? So he's showing for Devin Booker, but also uh, making sure that he blocks out his man for the offensive rebound. The white pal is not gonna make it look that easy. You know what I mean? There it is, right here. Perfect. Come on, for you guys that uh, say we we had Javale McGee at one point, he wasn't that good, bro. It's a whole different player, man. And you guys that know basketball know what I'm talking about, cause. That was the era of Shaq and the Fool and JaVale McGee was just looking crazy. Here it is right here. You know, you don't see a lot of floaters from him, but he can put it down. Here it is right here, post up on Christian Wood. Post up. Hey, got the little sky hook. Oh my God. Hey, this is going to be good for the Mavs, man. If you don't think this is a good look, you're smoking. Here it is, rolling. And, bro, I swear his layup package has gotten better over the years, bro. It's gotten better for sure. And these are against Christian Wood. Come on, man. You guys are say Christian Wood's a good uh, shot blocker. Uh, he's a good uh, defender in the paint. Come on, he's doing it against Christian Wood. There he is again. Hey, hey, menace, menace. There he is. He's out of the picture right here. Good box out. Gets up. Come on. Leave a like on this video. If you're excited to see. I'm at, I am didn't make sure I was recording. I don't know why I thought it was. Oh, my gosh. Naz needed a big man. Shout out to Nico for getting things done. And I want to say the Mavs are not done, bro. I don't know who they're going to be looking for. As you guys heard, um, there is. There are KD rumors out there. But Mavs just don't have the assets, obviously. And KD wants to go to the Suns or to the Heat. And, uh. That's a that's a uh, a topic for another day on KD man. Ah, just ruining the league. Anyways, like I said, let me let me know what you guys think about Javel McGee signing with the Mavs. We got our big man. Was it the big man you expected? It might not be Miles Turner. Uh, might not be Mo Bamba, but we got somebody and for cheap. You know what I'm saying? We got him for cheap. So I wouldn't say too cheap, but it's, it's pretty cheap for. The value he brings and remember looking at those stats you have to understand he's not playing a lot of minutes so 
Uh, you know, he was playing behind DeAndre Ayton. He's getting in and getting the, the bum minutes. So not really bum minutes, but you know, 15 minutes a game. Ah, you know, he's gonna have better numbers being the starter on the mat. That's all I'm saying. Anyways, I love you guys. Make sure you like the video, subscribe if you're new. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys. I'm out. Bro. Thank you.